<laughs> sit right down. Then watch with us. the show with us. All right. Well, the golf club at Oxford Greens is ranked as one of the best in the state. Today we're getting a chance to check it out as part of the Great Day Golf Tour. Caitlin Francis is there live to show us what we can find there. Kate, are you on hole number three? I heard number three is pretty good. Oh, Scott, we are going to go there in just a few minutes. We're on hole two right now. So a little teaser for one of the toughest holes. Hole three is one of the toughest in the state, right? Yeah, it was actually voted as the toughest hole in the state. Okay, we've got John here. He's the golf pro at Oxford Greens. Thanks so much for being with us this morning. Hey, thank you for having me. It's All right. good to be here. Well, we're so excited. This is, it's obviously, it's, I'm in my winter coat. I think I'm being a baby, but uh, <laughs> it's not that bad outside. It is pretty cold. The the wind's getting me pretty good, but uh, <laughs> we made him take we made him take his his jacket off. Uh, John, we're on hole two. This is where when people come out for tournaments, you hold a lot of tournaments here at the club, and uh, you you've got them specifically. People can come here. Uh, what's so special about this hole in regards to the tournaments that you hold? So this hole specifically, um, well, first of all, it's one of our most picturesque holes, as you can it see. It's really pretty. Uh, but um, we do our contests here, hole-in-one contest. Um, they can win great prizes if they make a hole-in-one on this hole. We give away cars, cash prizes up to ten, twenty thousand dollars $20,000, can win a vacation, all sorts of things like that. Okay, so those are real big prizes that you can potentially win. Uh, this is the hole-in-one. Well, if you're that good, you can, you know, make your swing at it. But um, you've got lots of very specific tournaments that you've got, like three this coming year that you're working on, right? Yeah, exactly. So um, we, as a club, host three uh, specific tournaments. The first one is called Board Shorts and Birdies. Um, that one's done in the springtime, or the summertime, yeah. sorry. Um, we're doing two of those this year. Uh, you can sign up online on our website, OxfordGreens.com. Um, you want to sign up early, definitely, because they sell out pretty quick. Um, sign up with our, uh, on the website, you can sign up for emails, and then they'll alert you of when, you know, those tournaments become available to sign up for. Okay. In the fall, there's Oktoberfest, which is another great tournament. Got lots of craft beer out here, um, prizes, contests, stuff like that as well. Uh, we have a high noon tent that comes out for that as well. Uh, and then in the fall, there is Toys for Joy which is a corporate fundraiser tournament. All the courses at Alliance do that. And um, this past year, we raised over 8,800 toys for uh, local charities uh, oh, around awesome. here. That's yeah. so much fun. And so obviously the one that you're gearing up for first is the it, board shorts and birdies, that's what you call it? Correct. So yeah. I I'm under the impression that people get really dressed up for that. Yeah, they do. Uh, we tell people to come out in costumes, uh, bathing suits, you know, to an extent, um, <laughs> but we have a costume contest. Uh, people last year, they really came decked out, lifeguard costumes, you know, fun colors, so it's a real good time. Everybody has fun at that one. Yeah, it sounds like a, a blast. So obviously here at Hold 2, this is the this is the, the one where you win the, could potentially win prizes, right? Yeah. Which we were just talking about, and it's a straight shot, basically. It is, yeah. You know, you don't want to go left because you got the water over there. Um, like today, the wind's blowing pretty good, so usually you gotta grab an extra club or two, um, keep the ball down, but yeah, not a bad hole out in front of you. All right, well, I mean, you're the golf pro, so can people ask you for tips too? Yeah, they can. Um, Oxford isn't really known for lessons per se. Uh, we are more of a golf facility. We want people to come here, play golf, have fun doing that, um, but they could. I'm always happy to you know, lend a helping hand when I can. And you make sure that they've got all of their, their gear and make sure that when they're going out into the greens that they're set and ready to go and have a good day. Oh, yeah. We got plenty of stuff in our pro shop, you know, balls, shirts, hats, everything to make sure that they're prepped and ready to go. Okay. So, John, when we come back here, we're heading down to the third hole, the toughest in the state. You're going to take a shot, right? Yes. Okay. I'm going to attempt to. You're probably better than you're letting on. It's fine. Um, <laughs> I did bring my clubs, guys. I know. <laughs> Whether or not I can actually hit the ball, we remain to see that. We'll come on back, and that's that's the best tease I can give you. All right. All right. That's the title of my new book, Whether or Not. Oh, I like that. You, like that? <laughs> you should actually have Kathy write I for you. Have in the book. That's a bestseller. Exactly. There you go. Thanks, All right, Kate. Thanks, Kate.